Hey guys, how's it going? So today I'm going to be taking a quick look at a beautiful new map slash graphics mod. The mod is called Realistic Maps by Harrison Fogg. By the way, Harrison Fogg is also the mod author who created the graphics mod I use in all of my Battlefront videos, the 2017 HD graphics mod to be exact. So at the time of recording, he's currently released res versions of the Death Star and Mustafar. And as far as I can tell, he will eventually work his way through all the vanilla maps. I know there have already been plenty of res maps made, but since this one is new, and I'm a fan of the author's work, I wanted to take a look at this. I've always been a fan of the vanilla maps. I mean, like, they're fun to play, and even quite decent to look at still. However, Battlefront 2 is getting quite old now, and compared to modern games, the textures definitely do show their age. But luckily for us, mods like this exist. By the way, make sure you use his graphics mod in conjunction with his res maps, it makes everything look a lot better. For inspiration, the mod author used the Star Wars movies as a reference. The general color scheme of both the Death Star and Mustafar has been darkened to better resemble the ambience given off by their appearances in their respective movies. So much like his graphics mod, his map mod tweaks a lot of the game's visuals but to a further extent. The ambient lighting is vastly improved, objects now have much more depth to them. Complete retexture of everything has been done, like it's all HD now. Light reflections and lighting effects has been vastly improved. Even panels and monitors have been tweaked to look more like the movies. All of those improvements lead to maps that look and feel much more like they were pulled straight from the movies. They give off a great cinematic atmosphere that breathes new life into these vanilla maps that would otherwise probably feel pretty damn stale by now. The maps are simple to download and install. Just rename the vanilla map file, then drag and drop the new one in. Simple. If you're interested in this mod, the link to the mod DP page is in the description as always. I highly recommend you download these two maps and keep an eye out for more maps to come. If these two maps are any indication, his next releases will be well worth it. I've pretty much covered all the important stuff, so I'm just going to shut up and let the little montage play. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one.